Dear Schwimmers, ICK, the acronym formerly known as HPV, is what my son has. ICK stands for imaginative, collaborative, cooperative. It is the acronym of champions. And like our son, decades of historical figures who have left their mark on society have done so because they too had ICK, the acronym formerly known as HPV. But one figure above all comes to mind, a class act, a man of men, a cultural icon who has transcended generations, a human being so powerful that he's become a god of mortals, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. My child is Dwayne The Rock Johnson, able to face adversity, say so many good things because of able to conquer challenges of mythical proportions able to make people laugh while instilling fear and respect in their hearts don't forget to include he plays well with others and is gentle like Dwayne the Rock Johnson my child is gentle kind and at the ripe age of four and a half, knows when to lay the smack down and when not to. Also, please take this seriously. Our child is also a scientific anomaly. Our child is a jumper. Don't forget to include that he is good at math. And we want the STEM Edge. Like Dwayne The Rock Johnson, my child has the ability to leap across incredibly long distances that would normally be physically impossible. He's also one with nature, and in a world where you are what you eat, my child is able to chew up and spit out the eternal rocks and sands of the playground, which would literally make him a rock. As you can tell, these scientific abilities are just some of the characteristics of a winner. A winner who would excel God, she has trust issues. Down here killing it on this essay. She can't let me be a genius. Drinking hate or aid. In your STEM education. Finally, Dwayne The Rock Johnson is giving up his time. He's everywhere, and we would be the same. PTA meetings, luncheons, board meetings. You'll soon realize we play the game like it's never been played before. We will climb the skyscraper, fly helicopters above earthquakes, and become the demigod of the Schwimmer world. Thank you for your time. Looking forward to the fall. Roger and Amanda. We are not using a professional wrestler as our historical figure.